always lived out this way and football is it's a big part of my kids' lives around here and everyone likes football. It's a real honour to play in the A-League for Western Sydney. I played for Carlingford Redbacks for about four or five years and yeah, that's where I first started kicking the ball. The mum told me that I came home from school one day and just said I wanted to, I wanted to play football. So yeah, that's the reason. I didn't, my family, I haven't got a football background in my family or anything. They were rugby league and stuff like that, so yeah. When I was a kid I always had a dream to go and play overseas. And well, when I was 16, I moved to England to play at Bolton Wanderers. That was my first real contract. So yeah, that was a great experience. Well, they're a top club in England, so it was very professional. So I was around top quality players um, and the facilities and everything was unreal. So it was a great place to learn the game. I was at Bolton for four years and then I decided that I needed to play first team football. So I went to Scotland, St. Moon. Um, I was there for two seasons, played a fair bit of first team football so that was good for my development and it was a great experience and I really enjoyed it. They're all nuts for the football over there, they, that's all they talk about so that was, it's a lot different to Australia where the paper is the back page, it's all football the sport, whereas here it's a couple of pages so it's, a, it's like live or die over there so everyone's into their football, so that was, uh, that was great. Well, I was still contracted to St. Mirren at the time, and um, everyone was talking about the Wanderers, so I talked to my agent, because I wanted to come back to Australia to try and play regularly more, and so I wasn't really enjoying it that much at St. Mirren at the time. So my agent looked into it, and then uh, set up a meeting with, for me to meet Papa. Um, yeah, I spoke to him and he sold me straight away the way he talked about what he wanted to do and the way he wanted to bring the team, build the team up and his thoughts on the game. So yeah, I was, I was into it straight away and yeah, that's how it came out. Yeah, it was unreal. Um, we didn't start off that well but we stuck to what the team believes in and that paid off throughout the season. We ended up winning the Premier's Plate, which was unbelievable in the first year. So, yeah, it was, uh, it's hard to describe how I feel about it, but I'm very proud. There's, there's obviously a lot more pressure on us this year because we won the league last year. So everyone's expecting us to do it again. We are as well. So, yeah, we're just going to stick to what we've been doing throughout the last two seasons. and. Um, hopefully that works again. Every player wants to push himself to the maximum level they can. Um, the level I'm at now is the A-League and that's where my head's at so I'm going to just try and play as well as I can and see where that takes me. If, uh, if it means that maybe in the future that I go overseas, then yeah, that would be unreal.